Hi everybody, today we are going to take a look in how to install the self-concealing turn signal in a speed twin. So this is a very interesting product, so I did on my bicycle, my motorcycle, and I'm going to share with you how we do that without cutting the electric, electrical wiring of the motorcycle in order to not lose the warranty. So this product comes with a manual that teaches you how to, to install that, but not specifically to the speed twin. So here you see, so in the, in the first photo on the left, that is the inside of the turn switch. So where we are going to, to insert two, two phones into that in order to disable the automatic, let's say, that click that, that holds the, the switch for the signal turns. So with that inserted there, we are not going to have that click that holds. So you just apply the pressure on the signal switch, then the signal switch comes back to original position and the uh, turn signal starts blinking and then automatically will come back as described in the manual. So in this first photo, you see that uh, kind of glue inside that, uh, that is a, a product that I put there in order to, to prevent the rust. It, it is called Corrosion XHD, so it's electrical compatible and rubber compatible, so that is going to keep safe my electrical wiring forever. Here I show you what are the specific wires inside the turn switch and also inside the head beam. So that's important uh, to know which wire is, is which because we're going to create, I'm going to produce a new electrical cable in order to unswitch the main switch and insert the cable that, I pro that I'm going to produce in order to not cut any wire. So if you need to return to original position, it's just to a matter of unplugging what you put inside and plug again the stock uh, plugs. Here show you how to build uh, the custom wire that's going to work as a bridge between the two connectors of the Stock, st stock connectors. So the model of this, these connectors is going to be presented at the end of this video. Here in the far left, I show you the inside the head beam. So the stock connector, so plug it and then unplug it. And, the, and, and to the right is our, now this, these same plugs already connected with the custom wire that I made, with the proper identification, what is what. So it's just uh, very self-explainable. In order to self-concealing system work, it has a module. And uh, the, the proper place to install the module that I found, the best way, it was uh, over Break the rear brake oil reservoir. So as you can see on the photo, I, I tied it with a zip tie. So it's running already for two years and uh, it never got any problem with that. So when we, when we read the manual of this modern system, so it's going to ask you to cut the wires of the motorcycle. The photo on the left so I show you, so here, here, in fact, there is no cutting. You just have to find the, the 12 volts positive and 12 volts negative, that is the ground. So where you, and mainly, so you're going to find the plug to the tail lights, and there you're going to energize your system. On the right, when you, ha you, when you see STS wire, that is the wire you have to use to tie to your signal lights. That means you have to cut the signal lines to make a kind of bridge. 
So I did not cut the tail lights wires. So in fact, I made the custom wire as you can see, and this comes from directly from the head beam. And uh, I make, remember that I made that bridge before with, with the, the wires. So with, with that bridge, I, I, I extended a cable to the STS model and the bridge was made here without cutting anything. And uh, specifically to speed twin, you have to bind the, the connectors, uh, the same connectors as you have your in your stock connection into the head beams. So you have to buy the male and the female connector connectors. I had a hard time finding those connectors. I have had a hard time find the code, the type, where to buy, and finally I found it in the AliExpress. Here is the link you're going to find the connectors and the, the type of the connectors that is a C-way, C-way code, C-way connector, six-way connector, uh, codes 6090-1218 and 6090-1149 respectively male and female and vice versa. So I hope this is helpful for you and uh, helps you to install this solution without cutting your wire, main wire of the motorcycle. Bye bye.